Hey guys, so we got a comment that asked about uh, actually adding comment or content on each one of these pages. Now you'll notice that I pretty much have the same thing. I I didn't actually keep that document, so I created a new one real quick. And as far as that goes, it's it's relatively simple. Instead of using the brush tool and drawing around like I did, you would just use the flash components to do it. So what I'll I'll just go ahead and show you real quick. It's set up for the most part exactly like before. We have our home uh, frame label on up to frame 5 and then about and then we have contact. So what you want to do is just click here on this first frame for home, the one that actually has the home frame label and then you want to start adding stuff. So. Let's go ahead and add a text box, and we'll say, here we'll lower this font down a little bit, and we'll change it to a less fancy font, here, this kind of looks like typewriting, so we'll use that, and we'll use a white font, because it's on a gray background. And then just type in some stuff. Welcome to my my site. Watching my videos. And one thing that I don't like about this is I have it to align center right now. Go ahead and have it justify, or even align left. There we go. Now we can click off of this, move this here, and that's basically how you add content. That's one way, at least. You can also use these components right here. Um, one second. Okay, so you can just throw in a button. Uh, component if you didn't want to make your own which is really not that bad to do you just change this to a button symbol give it an instance name and then you can double click on it and throw a label in there but anyway um, and skin it however you want by double clicking however we're just gonna go ahead and remove that for now and you have a lot of stuff here, but let's say that you wanted to do your contact page. So let's go ahead and click on, here let's add something in the about page real quick. We'll add a, hmm, when FLV playback component in here. And go ahead and put that in there. Okay, now let's go ahead and go up to the contact pane, uh, frame, and we'll do something pretty realistic with this real quick. So, name, and here we'll click off of it, click below, um, address. Click off and then click below again. And then something like uh, email. Okay. Then I'm just choosing the selection tool, clicking off of that. And then basically you could do um, all sorts of stuff. You could put a text input area in here which here we go, text input, drag that right there, and just keep and drag them onto the stage so that you can interact with them. You can make these bigger or smaller. You could also add a couple of check boxes as well. For different things. 
if you wanted to. And then let's go ahead and test the movie real quick. So you're on the home page. Welcome to my site. Thanks for watching my videos. If you click this, it doesn't do anything. But, okay, so then we click this. And it shows the FLB component right here. It doesn't show that black screen because it's not actually loading a video. This is basically saying that it's trying to load, but it doesn't have any content to. And then you click on the contact page and you have your name, like address, email, and then you can click on the checkboxes. And boom, you pretty much have a page. And then you'd want to wire it up with a uh, action script to be able to handle dealing with this data and so that it knows what to do with it. That's a basic to adding proper content and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave me comments and ratings so I know how I'm doing. Thanks guys.